My name's Kay Fensham. I'm 52 years old um, and I work as a quality inspector for a large company in Banbury. I've noticed recently that um, I've, my skin's started to sag here, especially um, with my neck aging me. Um, my cheekbones don't seem as defined as they used to be. And also around my mouth is a lot is saggy, so I would like sort of those areas especially tightened up. I don't think it's purely vanity. Um, I do think that we all like to make the best of ourselves. I, I know I certainly do. Kay is an existing client of mine, and I've known her for a number of years. I've always had her in mind for this kind of procedure because she has really the ideal face that's going to benefit most from the Silhouette Soft treatment. He's a lovely man, he's, he's chatty, you know, he makes you feel totally at ease. I'm really excited, um, really looking forward to seeing the after results um, and hoping that it will be a new start. I think for cheek area, you know, you already have quite prominent cheeks. I think a, li a little bit of a tweak just to take the weight off the nasolabial area here with one thread that's just going across here. That would look good. This is the um, silhouette needle going through now. Okay. The needle goes through, the thread follows, and then the cones will follow. Okay, so you have got the cone sensation now. So that's one. Right. Yeah? yeah, how is that for you? It's fine, yeah. So just five more of those. Okay? <laughs> so we're just going to tighten up those top threads first. Okay, okay. and then we'll do the bottom threads which will show more of a difference. These top mm -hmm. threads are more for locking the thread into place. So we'll start with this one. We'll start with the pull gently. Gently. Okay. There's an odd sensation, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I think that's really good. Now that's probably enough. We don't want to over tighten it. And then, so you can take some just regular painkillers if you feel the need. You may feel a bit sore, a bit swollen later on. Take a paracetamol or two, and okay. that, that should be really all that you need. Okay? You don't need antibiotics, but I will give you a, a little ointment just to apply to the needle areas. Okay. Do that once or twice a day for the next two or three days. Okay? Yep. And then you can also use some arnica to have the bruising and uh, uh, whatever other potions and things that you like to use. Makeup, generally in 48 hours is okay to apply. Okay. And just use normal cleansers and that? Yeah, so with cleansers, you need to avoid anything that would require you know, deep massage or rubbing or exfoliation. So generally, a bit of water and a, a foaming cleanser is much better. Okay. Does that make sense? Yeah. And be very gentle when you dry. Okay. Okay? Yeah. Brilliant. Thank you ever so much. Thank you. My face feels a little tight, but not uh, not uncomfy. I've got actually no pain whatsoever. Um, yeah, it, f it feels great. I'd just like to say thank you to Dr. Harb and everybody else that's been involved in the day. Um, it's been absolutely brilliant, and I'm really happy with the results. Thank you.